I mean, you know the game better how it goes, so if you just, you know, tell everyone to yeah. shut up. To do Welcome to Jag. Uh, we're playing Monster Prom. We're going to do the full game. Yeah, so uh, like that. Gonna... So when so when we're at a point where you think we should do the introduction, you should do that. But we are. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do it. I'm I know. Oh. Carry on. I can hear um, him twice, despite, despite having him muted. Oh my god, I'm trying to introduce everyone who's god. here. Gobbo, Gobbo, there he is. Yes, I, thank you, I'm here. Everyone knows also. that Gobbo's here. It's half his channel. Well, a third. Alright, well, third. somebody, 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 Janet, you read the, the dialogue. Okay, well... Also, Professor Pro and John Tonner are here. Yeah, Thanks yeah, for yeah. So, Yay. so, hi guys, we're playing Monster Prom. Which is about proming monsters. I'm not. I mean, I don't know anything about proms because I'm British and we don't have those. Because why would you? It makes no sense. Anyway, ah, spooky high school, the sweetest years of our lives. You don't have prom in Britain? No. <laughs> oh. Back then we were young and unafraid. I feel like I think, we can't just skip over. Hot. <laughs> I don't think John Tom was prom. <laughs> he wasn't allowed. Dude, you, you know me you know me so well. Do you want to go to the next text box so we can get through this? I was this? like, a party? That sounds stupid. Shut up, Johnson. You're things. ruining the video for all of our lovely people. <laughs> sometimes reckless, sometimes brilliant, sometimes just stupid, but always willing to live life to the fullest. It's okay, we were on a I wild journey either. to discover who we really were. Pony, did you go to prom? Yeah, I went to prom. Oh, all right, I want to um, pick I'm going to be... I feel like this is the Janet on the right. Yeah, that's uh, definitely Janet. Yeah, yeah. Right. Definitely. I feel like I feel like I'm a beautiful woman. Um, mm -hmm. The name is Gabo. <laughs> uh, I identify as a goblin, so I'm gonna say they. Makes sense. <laughs> uh, player two, this is John Todd. Um, All right. Uh, Which fuck is this guy? Oh goddamn it! Uh, so you're gonna be John Juan. Make my Juan. name Tuan John. Nah, John. too late now. I John can't Juan. Go back. <laughs> John Juan? Ta Tao Juan. <laughs> <laughs> and you're going to be oh, he. Juan. I don't <laughs> think you <laughs> Perfect. Uh, this should be Janet, right? Oh, is this me? Do I. Yeah, do I, don't, I, I don't have the controls. It's either you or a pwn. Uh, it's me. Oh, okay, it's pwn. Uh, what the fuck is that guy on the left? Uh, I think uh, it's pretty well. obvious what he is. <laughs> he's he's a he's, shadow man. No, he's a diglet. You can see the little diglet yeah, behind him. Like that whole person. That's what's usually underground. I think he's a shadow master. No, definitely a diglet. <laughs> Pono, are you are you going uh, with the name I think you're going with? Uh, <laughs> maybe something else. I can't see anything. Yeah, I can't see anything. We have to wait for. If you I'm like, this... I'm liking what uh, I'm liking Janet right there. So for uh, since I have more than one head, it's obviously not a Diglett. Oh, it's a yeah. trio. You're right. Yeah, that's actually my favorite Pokemon. Fun no. fact. But he's like yeah. three. It's a terrible fun. Pokemon. Yeah, well, because you get three for the price of what you get three Pokemon in one ball. That seems unfair. <laughs> Who else can you do with that stupid crab? <laughs> Doug trio. <laughs> and uh, I guess I'll be this one. Yeah, it seems like actually I yeah. kind of imagine your girlfriend like that, but without the bolts in her hair. Oh yeah. <laughs> I feel like you need to identify as a woman. We got all the other genders there. Oh, of course. Jan, anyway. if at any point you want to add the original monster mash to any of this, <laughs> <laughs> I am not um, doing that. <laughs> I guess we're going to experience the ultimate challenge: the monster prom. Ah, uh, we all remember it clearly as we fantasize about our dream prom dates. Uh, as we try to catch the attention of, attention of the six most charismatic classmates, Miranda Vanderbilt, the sweet mermaid princess who is cute as she was genocidal, Jonathan will haunt her. Damien oh, LeVay, a fearless demon with a taste for destruction and love for fire. It's probably Janet. Scott Howe, a werewolf athlete with compassion for his rather small brain with a I, stupid. I know John's heart. been saying that he's kind of got a crush on the werewolf. <laughs> yeah, John, you like, are you a bear? Oh, crap. That one's <laughs> mine, isn't it? Mm hmm. <laughs> Uh, this is this is this is Pones right here. Polly Geist, oh, a party ghost. Cute. <laughs> yeah, she's my girl. Uh, and this is the one I'm I like. I'm gonna fight you for it. Although the Medusa is pretty pretty hot. Yeah, she's self so aloof. Gorg Oh no, we have to take a personality test. We don't yeah. actually get to pick. <laughs> oh really? Oh okay. Yeah. Yep. It asks you silly questions. Oh, that sounds yeah. fun. So we only got three weeks to get our prom date. Uh, oh, who did God. you go to prom with, Pone? I think you're the only one who here who actually went to prom. Uh, I mean, oh, we had oh. bulls. 
You didn't go to prom, Gabo? Yeah, I never went to prom. I went oh. to college for my junior and senior year of high school. Well, oh aren't you God, Mr. Smarty McSmarty? Uh, okay, so we're going to do the Monster Pop Stupid Pop Quiz. All mines are rotten, but they were rotten so many different ways. Worry no more. We're using our PhD and bullshit to diagnose which kind of deviant sicko you are. Can I, can I just uh, say that it's wonderful that this magazine is called Teen Wolf? Yeah, but my yeah. favorite is the crazy exes, how to yeah. deal with them, they just won't go away. Uh, <laughs> I, I thought we were, I thought we liked the, uh, the shark. Yeah, but uh, this, so this yeah. is gonna, this is gonna reflect your true stats, alright? So all here right. we go. I hope we get different questions. Hey, and I that, did a dry I'm run. pretty sure that was Planet Express. Gabo, yeah, if you had to have we, sex with an animal, which animal would it be? What? Yeah, we <laughs> didn't have this question. <laughs> a swan, you're classy, plus it reminds me of the myth of the uh, Lita and the swan. So at least to be bestiality standard, it has a certain cheek appeal. A human being, because I'm the kind of douchebag who loves to find loopholes and stupid questions like this one. <laughs> a great white shark. If I had the fucking animal, let's at least make a story worth telling. John <laughs> Tom, which one are you going to pick? Uh, I'm going to go number two. Yeah, right, and, and if he said do that before the game starts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with Gabo. Yeah, All Janet, right, I feel like you're a classy gal. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a swan. British right? people are always classy. Yeah, I mean, I'm British, <laughs> I've gotta try and have sex with a swan. Remember to vote, democracy is just broken. What would be the best way of choosing leaders of modern society? Uh, you put all the candidates in an empty room with a wild grizzly bear. I'm done. I'm not even reading the rest of them. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let me, let me read it. Uh, the rest of them, whoever can play the most heartbreaking uh, violin solo wins. We create a reality show called America's Next Top President, where the candidates compete in all kinds of physical and mental challenges. Voter turnout uh, would increase and would turn a profit for us. I'm going to have to go with the first one as well. <laughs> you just follow it. John Time, be your own person. <laughs> I, I am being my own person. Maybe you, it's uh, you who's got me and me. It's all huh? about the reality yeah. TV. A reality show. Huge. Oh wow! I'm being I'm being my own person in all of these questions. I'm going for the heartbreaking <laughs> violin solo. Ooh. I find violins uh, incredibly sexy. What would so be a this. killer accessory? Mm, sunglasses at night. God, I don't even know if I want to even look past this. That's lame. That's pretty. Lame. A necklace with your own name on it. Uh, coolness itself. Fancy brass knuckles. Shiny armor. A fabulous purse made from the skin of your worst enemy. I wear my yeah, sunglasses. I think sunglasses. Glasses, uh, I'm going with coolness so itself. Coolness see. itself, because John Tom lacks it. Oh, I got him. I wear uh, my sunglasses. Since Gabo chose sunglasses at night, I oh, shall go with something else. Dude, what is up with your Please. face? Are those supposed to be your eyes or something? Are those are yeah, eyebrows. Don't, don't, those get, are eyebrows. eyebrows. don't get personal you here, are okay? It's so be... racist, it's unbelievable. Why, why are your eyebrows white together. Together. Let's see you as a shadow? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, but that's because that's Shadow Online Gaming right there. So, Pone, have you, have you picked yet? Okay, yeah, he cool. picked. Oh, I was going to go with a purse. Uh, sorry. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to go with a purse. Yes, I'm going to make it out of too. you. Ooh, you had the same love interest. I forgot who mine was. We skipped it too fast. Gabo! Uh, what do I would do? I what didn't even I see do? what my love interest was. Uh, well, we have the Medusa. Oh, okay. I think, uh, who do I have? I don't remember. Oh, is the Medusa... You'll you find out. you find out really, really All right, quickly. Um, I'll go to the auditorium then. Uh, that day while rehearsing for class play, as though the muses themselves ascend to give you a figurative uh, oral pleasure, you perform an intense and inspiring, uh, but what we remember for generations, which is pretty rad at high school play standards. You gain plus two creativity. Mm. Ooh, what's going on here? Scott and pa oh, Scott and Polly pull you aside. One of them is holding uh, uh, each hold of your hands, whatever's going on, and it's serious. Uh-oh. <laughs> we need your help, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the midterms of AP, scare, uh, AP jump scares Hang is coming on, I up. I feel like you shouldn't be doing all of the voices. Okay, you can do that. I, I think we need to dish these out, some people. All right, well, I'm going to be the werewolf. do you want to be the, the, this chick, the ghost chick? Yeah, I can, I can be uh, the hip ghost chick. All right, brilliant. Go ahead. The midterm for AP jump scares is coming up tomorrow, and we're so unprepared. We tried to do everything we could to think and get ready. I rolled up the textbook and smoked it. <laughs> <laughs> and I ate up my homework. But nothing worked. We've only got one option left. So we got to cheat, bro. We just need to figure out how we can do it without messing up, messing with the teacher. Or messing with the teacher. Either way, <laughs> if you can help us, we'd be super grateful. I like these two. Um, that's the incentive you need. Uh, you hook them up with your ultimate cheating technique. 
Uh, hold on. Just take the test like normal, and then use this time machine to go back and change the answers. Write all the answers on the teacher so I can never see them there. <laughs> I like, I like I'm gonna go with that one. That's a great one. <laughs> Ooh, so oh, yes, 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 yes. Mr. Giant Stonehead is like 99% base. <laughs> it's perfect. And I've heard he sleeps like a rock too. This is. This will be so easy. But isn't this vandalism? Coach says winners don't do vandalism. <laughs> no, silly. It's only vandalism if you're doing it on a not alive thing. This is makeup artistry. <laughs> uh, you make a mental note to never let Polly do your makeup. You gain two fun and one smart. <laughs> All right, John, Tom, where do you want to go? All right, let's uh, let's go. Uh, let's I feel go. Like you need to go to the bathroom. You're talking about taking a number two earlier. <laughs> let's go to the gym, bro. All right. You would. You gotta read, John. Tom, it's you. That day, an epic dodgeball match takes place. Everything seems lost, but you deliver an inspirational speech that fills your steam spirit. Leading to a spectacular comeback. You're clearly a natural born leader. You gain plus two charm. <laughs> <laughs> you look at the fine Liam and Scott waving their phones in each other's faces. I feel like this is Janet. <laughs> <laughs> what about this one? No, nah, I'm definitely swipe left on that, that one, bro. But this one is my best picture! <laughs> but it's not even a picture of you. It's just a photo of a stop sign wearing a top hat. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's artistic? I don't know. Maybe if it's a picture of a fire hydrant. <laughs> well, it's not as if your pictures are in any way superior. What are we even doing in this one? Um, smiling. See? Unacceptable! But I like my. Are you sure it's wrong? Of course I am! Look! I'll even bring an impartial third party! Probably Tanjon. Probably. <laughs> you! You're renowned for your Tinder success! This is John Ton! <laughs> <laughs> What's your secret? It is John. Yeah, well, what's your secret, John Ton? Alright. Okay, so the options are, I don't just smile with my face, I also draw a smiley face on my bare chest. That's not me. I shock and amaze oh. with my custom Instagram filter, sepia, mustache, and nipple. That's definitely the second one for me. Alright. Sepia, mustache, and nipple. I've never heard of. I mean, of course I've heard of it. I'm the only one who's ever heard of it. But I, uh, I got a new phone and my settings got all messed up, so do you think you could transfer it to me? Liam is clearly impressed by Jonathan's filter game, but don't expect to <laughs> him to ever mention it again. You get <laughs> two smarts and one creativity. All right. All right there, Doug Trio. Doug Trio, I choose you. Doug Trio, uh, Doug Trio. In classic fashion, I shall start at the bathrooms. <laughs> <laughs> that day you skip class and just hang out in the bathroom because you respect no authority. I guess some people just want to watch the world burn. By skipping class and hanging out in the bathrooms, you get plus zero shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love this already. Later day you're out shopping with Vera and Polly when a wild cock drives <laughs> Wow. It gallops through the mall. Fighting shoppers with its jagged and turning them to stale. Who's gonna be the Medusa chick? Uh, uh, that's John Ty. Hasn't got a name yet. yet. Oh what? Oh yeah. Okay, yeah. So I'm doing something now. Yeah, you'll, be, you'll be the Medusa, uh, Vera. All right. Scott and Damien come chasing after it, holding a butterfly net <clears throat> and a frilly dress. Oh my God! There's all kinds of people. <laughs> wow. This <laughs> isn't our <laughs> fault. Oh, we no, need to no, be demon. No, no, yeah, we've all got a voice. This guy's mute. <laughs> <laughs> well, somebody's got to read it. Well, right. we can do more than one voice. And who, I guess it's your turn. Maybe, he's, maybe whoever's turn it is. <laughs> All right. Yeah, he can be. He'll just be an enigma. We he'll always have a different to do voice. With this. <laughs> oh, another mythical creature crisis. <laughs> just when I'm starting to enjoy my shopping. Ah, oh, but it's so cute. I bet that vicious chuck and dragon yeah, really it. knows how to party. Scott Scott Davis. You can be the narrator if you All want. Right. Scott and Damien see everyone looking at them and wisely hide inside the clothing rack. What are you going to do about this creature? Your friend oh. with the delicious Cinnabon. <laughs> 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 
How did you know a Cinnabon is a cockatrice's favorite treat? It gulps a tasty cinnamon bun in one bite and burps happily. As you turn your back shopping, it follows you, seeming he's got a new friend. Okay, obviously we need to take this hideous creature out clubbing with us, because duh! Well, I suppose that's a novel way to spend an evening. Ooh. You take the cockroaches back to the hottest club and let you in because they don't they don't want to be murdered by the cockroaches. <laughs> you gain two fun and one charm. Oh, that's super. Janet! Oh, holy Janet. shit, it's my turn. Where the hell am I gonna go? I don't know, what do I like? Classroom? Well, you're probably boring going to library. the library. <laughs> Spooky tree. <laughs> uh, yeah, you wanna go outside, Janet. Is that everywhere? Mm -hmm. Can I just leave? You uh, can't go to art places. <laughs> yeah. yeah, okay. So I think it's classroom, library, or tree, innit? Yeah, you would never go to a tree, oh, though. You're God. British. British uh, don't like trees. <laughs> British people have trees. What are you about? Uh, yeah. I might go to the librarian. British people love libraries. Duh. Oh. That day, you spent some time in the library's PCs, playing some good old online poker. Oh, I have to press something, do I? Yeah, you there have to go. press cool. it. Shh. Uh, gambling <laughs> seems like a stupid and dangerous decision. But who cares? This time it paid off, so fuck it. You gain plus two money. <laughs> right. the money, Always money, the money. You, you Later, you see Miranda and Vera cornered by a wolf pack who are watching yeah. them like a pack of wolves. <laughs> <laughs> no shit. Uh, okay, who's doing this guy's voice? Is he another mystery uh, person? Uh, he, he's, he's a minor character. He's like go on a yeah, he's a minor character. The dogs ever to not be literal hot dogs. Oh, John Thomas doing a voice? I thought I he was think, clearing his yeah, throat. I think he was doing a voice. <laughs> <laughs> he was clearing his throat. You okay there, buddy? You okay? Should we carry on? Yeah, I carry yes, on. I said okay. the words. That's also know. John Thomas. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this chick now? It's I've you. I've done her either. Alright. This is not at all how I like my courtships to begin! Where are the jewels? Where are the flowers? <laughs> yeah, everyone sounds like that. She sounds a bit more like <laughs> Mickey Mouse than the previous one. Yeah. Where are the bloody heads of my enemies? <laughs> Oh what? man, we'll show you courtship on the court when we win on the court at sports. I like this guy. He's uh, articulate. Yeah, we should go with him to the prom. We'll show you sportship courtship. Every time I think the guys at this school can't get any dumber. <laughs> no, you're doing a Mickey Mouse voice. We're all, they're all <laughs> Mickey Mouse now. What? what? No, I was doing the high-pitched voice first for her. Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> Moving on. I was! <laughs> Oh, I get it. You're bow shy. Don't worry. Our barks are worse than our bites. Except Jasper, when we're doing sports. <laughs> no, I'm what? Except when we're doing sports. What if neither of you had the confidence to say which one wants to go out with us tonight? We can just choose for you. Yikes! Looks like they're re uh, <laughs> they're relatively well intentioned, but you should definitely step in and save one of them. Just one? Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ooh, your options are tonight, uh, Miranda can't. I have two tickets to the Circus de la Ma's underwater show, or I don't want to go out with you, Bear. I hear her snakes have syphilis. <laughs> Ooh, that's pretty convincing. That's pretty convincing. Uh, guys, who, who the hell is my love interest in this game? Uh, I don't remember. Someone uh, clicked past Both it. of ours were Vera. But you can you can actually ask anybody out to the prime. I think you just start off slightly person's Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, well, which one do you feel is it more like you? What is your soulmate? Yeah, it's it's tough to call. I mean, they I mean they both sound like Mickey Mouse, which I'm into. But how can I decide between them? Uh, I go for Vera. Yes, that's exactly right. They do have syphilis. Poison flows through my very veins. I have a powerful, dangerous bad bitch. Oh, I picked the right one. Fear me, you puny little mortals, and fear my ability to destroy you effortlessly. Uh -huh. Yeah, she actually ended up being like a mom. Uh, you know what? I think I just heard Coach calling us. Oh, Coach, 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 Oh, very yeah. well. Yeah, so guys, and, uh, next time a Jag. We'll see you at lunch.